We're in the fruit garden here at Eastern Wall Gardens and um, we've got a few raspberries here which uh, you might struggle to see at first because it's quite clever really, they're growing them through gooseberries. And if you've ever grown raspberries you'll know that all sorts, whether they're autumn raspberries or summer raspberries, all need a little bit of support. Well these are autumn raspberries and they're just growing up through the gooseberry plants um, so they don't need any time at all, they're just popping up where they want to. Um, as you can see we've just got a few fruit left on here. We're getting in well into the autumn now, so not many left. Um, pruning causes a little bit of confusion with raspberries, um, but with the autumn types like this one, um, very, very simple. So once they've finished fruiting, once you've picked the fruit, all you have to do is get your secateurs and go right to the very bottom of the cane and just cut it off at ground level. And that's literally all you do. Um, with the summer ones, slightly more complicated, in that you cut off the canes which have fruited this year but leave the ones which will have grown up from the base during the season. Um, and one good way of doing it, normally grow them along posts and wires, um, is to train the fruiting canes one way and the new canes the other way um, so that it makes it really obvious which ones you've got to take off. Also stops them becoming a real tangle um, and makes it easier to pick the fruit too. Um, so very simple really, autumn raspberries, finish fruiting, you can cut them right down to the base. Um, with the summer ones, again, when they've, once, they've, once you've picked, you cut off the canes which have been fruiting, uh, fruited for you that season, and you leave the others um, to grow on obviously to produce your crop in the following year. Um, sometimes if you leave the autumn fruiting ones on, you can get um, a crop in the second season. Um, some of them will do that again, but it will be a much lighter crop. Um, tends to mean that they, they harbour diseases, so I prefer to cut them right down.